Okay guys, here we go. Complete transformation process for Voyager class bulkhead. This is from the Transformers Prime series. Just again a reminder, this is only the transformation process. The review is separately uploaded. So if we turn our attention to the shoulder pad things, lift them up, close them together, keep them out of the way. Lift them up, close them together, keep them out of the way. Now we've got a bit of fun to be had here with the arms. What we're gonna do, if you turn the orientation of the under the shoulder, see so you've got this little notch on the side, turn that to the front and then hold on to that notch and then turn the forearm. So you've still got the spring at the front there to face the side, fold the fist in. So what we did, we're gonna turn this shoulder bit here. So hold the black part, turn the silver bit in like so. Then you're gonna take the forearms, you're holding onto the silver part, turn the forearm out to face the body in with the spring there and then fold the fist up. What we're then looking to do is separate the whole back of the vehicle like so, extend this all the way up and out and then you can press the head in and click that into place. This is now giving us enough clearance to fold the arms all the way back. And now this is the test if you've got the right orientation. See, you've got that large tab there and this cutout there. You can just lock them in. If you've not got them in the correct orientation, that's your finished article, basically, basically guys. Fists folded up, springs on the side and joined in the middle. Now it's a bit like a jigsaw. We're gonna take what were the shoulder pieces. If we bring this carefully underneath the roof, turn it around 180 degrees and slot this into position in the back. We're gonna do the same on the other side. So bring this down, turn it around. It is a ball and socket, so be nice and careful, and then push that into position. We've then got what are the chest pieces, and again, we're gonna do the same thing. Bring this out, line it up, and click it into place. Same on this side, bring this round, click it up, line it into place. Then what we're gonna do, we're gonna turn our attention to the front, and what we're gonna do first and foremost is we're gonna take the legs, and we're going to 180 degree spin these all the way around. So if we turn this this way, that's one facing backwards the way we want it. That's one facing the other way with the way we need it. Then what you're going to do, you're going to take hold of the wheel arch or the rim. And you're going to literally, you're going to try and turn this. Oh, let's get this right. Fold it all the way backwards like so. And then you can click the foot back in. So what I did was I took the wheel arch. I twisted it all the way back. Let's have another go. Can we see what we're doing here? So we're gonna bring this, see how this moves? Push this, oh, it's just locked in on the foot. There we go. Push this all the way back like so. So the toes part are facing forwards and then click the foot into the back. So it can be tricky as you can see. This is what we're looking at now. So everything's folded up. Let's take the front of the vehicle, lift this right up. Now what we need to do is lift these leg parts forwards, condense, in fact, fold them this way rather, bring them that way. So this folds back on itself and you can see we're gonna bring the wheels underneath like so. So this is gonna fit into where this bumper is and fold the bumper part over. It's just a case now again of clicking it all into place. So you folded the legs under themselves. This will, even if it doesn't line up, what you can do is just correct the position, push it forward. Then what we need to do is of course fold the arms in. It's the same principle, bend these in. Oh, they've just separated again. It's okay if they do. Just push this together. Once it's in, push them into position and then it's just a case of folding down the sides of the vehicle like so. And then as I say, a bit like a jigsaw, a bit like compressing everything together, turn it around to this side and just line and push everything in. Can be quite tricky that one guys, but there you have in his alternate mode. Okay, going back to robot mode, this is far more simple. It's just a case of, I suppose, unfolding everything. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna take the back of the vehicle, let's lift this up out of the way. Same on this side, bring it up, looks like a DeLorean now. Get the arms, fold these out, bring them down, out of the way. Come to the legs, same principle, separate the legs, bring them down. So you're folding it down and you're getting it out of the way. Then if you remember, what we need to do is turn the legs all the way around, turn the legs all the way around. And then we're gonna take what are gonna be the front part of the feet. We're gonna bring this forward and then we can bring the toes. So if we separate these toes at the back and again, just click these forwards like so. So what we did was we brought the whole shin part forward. Oh, it's just getting stuck. There you go, see it slide round Then bring the feet underneath and this will click into place. You know you've got it in the right place because if I turn it underneath, see you've got these little tabs there which fit into the side of the feet. That's what we're looking to do. Let's fold this bump a bit under itself then because this is of course going to be the front now we need to bring the front windows round first and foremost to be the chest part bring this so separate it nice and carefully bring this around then 
we're going to bring what of course are going to be the shoulder pieces just bring them right up and out of the way for now right up and out of the way and then this is the bit that i struggle with because i've got little hands i'm going to bring the arms around and as you do this we need to try what you can do is just bring this forward on that flip but as you can see i can't do it so what i do is i reach underneath push forward and then that's separated this tab so now i can get my hands underneath at me nails and bring it underneath to bring the head he says through there we go through the gap in the roof clip it down so let's just take the arms bring these right round and underneath what are going to be the shoulder pads let's lift them out of the way and of course the back of the truck then if we keep the back of the truck lifted up let's fold this down get it out of the way there's a cutout in the back there put that in there out of the way start to clip everything into place so with regards to the arms what we need to do is hold at the shoulder turn this out till you've got that lined up hold at the elbow joint turn the wrist forwards open the fist come to the shoulder turn at the shoulder so you've got the working cogs on the inside turn the fist pull it out and now it's just a case of taking the shoulder piece opening it up and then very carefully what i need to do this is going to be a bit more difficult than i thought because i've come the wrong way around is up over the top there we go and around so you've got the autobot logo on that shoulder and then this side if you open it up you've just got the black part there for it to fit underneath and that is the oh, full transformation there you go guys thanks for watching like and comment and don't forget to subscribe